What's going on? This is Garrett. I am at City Hall right now. I just got out of Tom Mullen's office. Met with him for about a minute. Um, he doesn't want to be audio or video recorded, and he said as long as those conditions are laid down, he's willing to talk about the case. He asked if I was there representing myself, if I had counsel, and I told him I can only speak for myself and that I do not have an attorney. I will be representing myself in court if it gets to that. Um, doesn't mean I won't be consulting with one. Um, so he agreed to meet with me tomorrow in private. Um, I'll be allowed to take written notes and that'll be tomorrow at 10 a.m. Uh, that'll be Wednesday, May 22nd. So yeah, throw this out there. This is the latest on the Robin Hood of Keene lawsuit. Um, Pete Ayer is the only other person I believe who's tried to communicate with the city. He went in with a video camera and Tom Mullins, the court jester, said that he was not willing to meet with him on those conditions or speak with him on those conditions. I'm Pete Ayer. I just want to let you know I'm filming. Yeah, we'd rather you know that okay if we're going to talk about anything. Well, uh... I would hope you'd be all right with it, seeing that it's, uh, we're in a public building, you're a public employee. No, but I'm not okay with it, so if you'd like to talk with me and chat about the petition, that's fine, we can do that. Turn off the video I don't know why an objective record is such a feared thing by the legal department of Keene uh, City bureaucrats. There goes an officer right now. But, yeah, so we'll see tomorrow what it brings. I'm going to ask, basically, why I've been dragged into this case what evidence there is that I have anything to do with harassment of city officials and um, why it is that these allegations are made against myself and others because nobody specified in the case everywhere it just says they did this and they did that um, listing our names in the beginning there's maybe one instance where there's an incident recalled with one of the individuals and the other five people aren't mentioned specifically as doing anything wrong anywhere